Hey there guys, today is time for your first lesson in Scratch. Today we're going to learn the basics of the new Scratch app. So, to start your coding, that's what we're learning today, how to do basic code. You're going to need to have an events key. So when the flag is clicked is the basic one, so when you click the flag, your animation will begin. Then we're going to choose to move our cat here. We're going to choose to move him... 15 steps. Let's try that out. There we go. He's now moving 15 steps each time. If that's 15 steps. What does one look like? Okay. Anyway, we're going to choose to move him 15 steps. Then we're going to get him. We're going to go into looks. We're going to drag this in and get him to say hello. That's just basic code. So if we try that now. He's going to walk 15 steps, then say hello. This to look good, I'm going to get him to walk 100 steps. There we go. And then he says, hello. Say we didn't want this sprite anymore. We can delete him. We can get a new sprite by going to choose a sprite. We can paint our own or choose one of Scratch's already done ones. I'm going to have a talking piece of bread. And I think that's a bit small for my talking piece of bread. So I'm going to go into the size box down here and change it to 300. And I have a giant baguette. And I'm going to change the name of it to Barney Bread. There we go. This is Barney Bread. I'm going to do some code with Barney Bread. I'm also going to get another sprite. I'm going to call this one Barney Cheesy Puffs. Now we have Barney Bread and Barney Cheesy Puffs, and we're going to code something. So let's do the basic code, but we also want a backdrop. I'm just going to have them in on the boardwalk for now. Barney Bread and Barney Cheesy Puffs. Okay, we're going to start with Barney Cheesy Puffs. We're going to say, when flag clicked, he's going to say... Hello bread, and that's going to take him two seconds. And for the bread, when the flag is clicked, we're going to get him to wait two seconds, because otherwise he will be talking at the same time as Barney Cheesy Puffs. So he's going to wait two seconds, then say, Hello. He's going to say, Hello Barney Cheesy Puffs. And then, that's all. Let's try the code. See, now we've got them both talking. That's just some basics in Scratch. You can even add sounds. So after he said, hello, Barney Cheesy Pops, Puffs, we will play the sound pop. Just like that. Now that's a cool animation, but it's not so good. What if we gave Barney Cheesy Puffs another costume so that Barney Cheesy Puffs could turn into a ballerina? So, he's going to say, hello bread. So this takes four seconds. So after he said, hello bread, and he said that for two seconds, we're going to get Barney Cheesy Puffs to wait two seconds now this is a different costume so we've got to go into looks and get him to switch his costume and then we're going to get him to say something we're going to get him to say i am now a ballerina and he's now a ballerina so that's our code, and that's pretty cool, and that's just some basic code in Scratch. I'll see you in the next lesson to learn more about Scratch. Bye for now, and before you go, I'd just like to make this ballerina giant. That'll look awesome. There we go. She can eat the bread as well, yum yum. Bye for now!